The biggest challenges facing our clients who are developing autonomous vehicles are a bespoke solution is required and a one-size-fits-all approach is not really going to solve their issues. We work very closely with our clients in their specific application. The biggest challenge is overall dealing with uncertainty from a technical perspective. We don't just take an off-the-shelf product, one size fits all. We understand that in this specific market, uh, every uh, customer will have different requirements, different needs. It is more looking at what are the best pieces from a hardware and software perspective to bring together to the, solve that challenge. And we're trying to see what could we bring to the table to help satisfy customer needs. The autonomy development platform is performing very well due to its flexibility in architecture and its ease of integration. We're considered an industry standard because we provide consistent positioning and output information with systems that are robust and provide a very, very accurate output throughout any kind of challenging conditions. We started out in open pit mining for the guidance of autonomous vehicles. We have now applied our localization and other technologies to ports and harbor applications for automation of that. We've also done the construction applications and agriculture. Well, the biggest uh, start to everything was uh, the DARPA challenge back in 2007, 2008, and that's where uh, we really got our uh, feet wet and uh, we partnered up with some pretty big names out there. Our service offering is very comprehensive, not just from a product perspective, but from the upfront business and technical consulting that we do with the client. The team at Aplanix, we're, we have the best and the brightest in the business. Uh, we have people from a deep navigation and geomatics background. Experts in mobile robotics who have PhDs in navigation systems and in machine learning. We also have a great customer support staff, which is available 24-7 to assist clients worldwide at a moment's notice. The component tree on an autonomous vehicle really depends on what the application is, but generally, like the vehicle behind me, you will have sensors such as LIDARs, cameras, radars, perhaps ultrasonic sensors, and then at the heart of the system to know where it is is a GPS INS system. We take things a step further by also incorporating the localization algorithms that we do in-house so that we have multiple redundant sources of measurement for exactly where we are. Aplanix is a leader in this industry because we pioneered the concept of what's called direct georeferencing, and we have now expanded that concept to real-time applications of similar technology to go to the uh, autonomous vehicle that you see behind me today. I think what Aplanix is great at, what we have products and algorithms that allow our clients to better trust their position. If you have anything on wheels or on track, and it drives on the ground. If you're trying to create any kind of robotic applications, test validate algorithms, navigate or collect maps, you should be calling us. 